Modern child researchers are indebted to the pioneering work of the Swiss psychologist Jean Piaget. Piaget identified six stages in the development of an infant's practical cognitive intelligence. The first stage, called reflexes, lasts only the first month of a baby's life. At this stage, behavior is limited to basic reflexes such as crying, sucking, and grasping. During the second stage, from the first through the fourth month, infants adapt their reflexes to the world around them. Four-month-old Carmen now knows that nursing requires different skills than chewing on this toy, even though both grew out of the sucking reflex. In the third stage of sensory motor development, between four and eight months, infants become aware of and respond to people and objects. The more Boris shakes the rattle, the more noise it makes. Johnny knows this is good coffee. He's at the fourth stage, anticipating events and adapting his behavior to get what he wants. Did you want coffee, silly bear? Did you want coffee for the silly bear boy? Young Christopher has a different approach. He'll ask for his uh, bottle, you know, he'll point or, or he'll get his bottle. Sometimes if uh, it runs out, he'll put it in front of your face. <laughs> After their first birthdays, toddlers enter the fifth stage, experimentation and creativity. Piaget called children at this stage little scientists. They're into everything. By the sixth stage, two-year-olds are beginning to solve problems in their heads before acting out a solution. With these developmental milestones behind them, children's lives become richer as they incorporate fantasy, pretend, and complex communication. Um, you want some more? Yes. More, please? Please. Okay.